Hello, you guys. Thank you for coming back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, y'all. Now, if you are if you are interested in the sage spiritual candles, I have that on my website. On my website, you will you will see over a hundred products, you guys. I can't name them all. I don't like to do uh, I don't like to do that on this channel, naming a whole bunch of shit. I want to get straight into the fucking reading here. Let's see what's happening. You can watch this for any placement in Aquarius. I see some boredom here. Okay. Yeah, I know you probably ready for something new now. A lot of y'all are, you know, running away from some bullshit, okay? I feel like some of y'all had problems here with with Libra, a fire sign, or probably some water energy. I definitely see it here. See this energy here? Doesn't look good at all. So it looks like there was a lot of problems. I'm seeing some health problems here. Some Aquarians out here. What's going on? Somebody sick around you? Are you sick? Be careful out here. You know we got fucking COVID and all type of shit. Did you get your shots yet? There's something going on here. All right. For those of you dealing with a fire sign, I feel like you're going to make a decision about this person today. Okay. And I also see that you are going to go into this four swords resting here. Okay. Formulating a plan, honey. Here comes some controlling energy here. This could be a boss or this could be a Taurus Aries you guys are dealing with. Okay. Some of you might have Taurus or Aries in your chart. You know what I mean? But if you do, honey, you're gonna you're gonna be a control freak. Definitely. Your way or the highway. You got fire energy coming towards you. Some of y'all could be dealing with Leos or Aries or something like that right now when this energy comes in i feel like this person comes off you know like a family person you know very serious or independent you know i see that energy there i also feel like a soulmate connection is coming through that's a place of scorpio some of you dealing with cancer place scorpio yeah and i see somebody getting their wish fulfillment here with the nine of cups But there's no balance in the situation somewhere. It could be with money. It could be with stability. Whatever it is, I feel like there's no balance. Somebody's giving more than the other person in this situation. Now, family is very important to you around this time. But one thing for sure, I feel like there's some ups and downs, okay? Especially if you're dealing with fire placements or water placements gonna make you want to isolate yourself okay and while you're doing that somebody's on the outside watching you okay somebody's trying to figure out if you're juggling okay this is what the person wants to know are you juggling okay for those of you that have a person you're dealing with and that person has Virgo in their chart I feel like there's probably some good news around that situation communication commitment or love offers okay but i feel like there's going to be some money problems that might make you run away after a while you know what i mean <laughs> yeah it looks like <clears throat> it looks like something's going on here i see you guys running okay from something it's like you're not even getting something started yet and it, it and you just change your mind real quick. And that reading is for somebody out there. Somebody's going to change their they mind fast as hell. Like, hold up. I don't think I want to do this. All right. So, 
I feel like somebody is very uncomfortable within their home. Losing stability. Somebody could be common law married or something here too. Um, and I see earth energy coming in. When this earth energy comes in, there's going to be nothing but conflicts around it, around this earth energy. Or somebody's hating on your status, okay? Somebody's like, oh, you think you this shit? Fuck you, you know? Um, I see big changes here. And I feel like your intuition is blocked. Open your eyelids, man. Somebody's, somebody's doing something here. Somebody might disappear. You know, decide to move or something. Or somebody might come into some money real quick. And here comes the soulmate connection. Again, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. What are you going to do about this? Because this is an on and off relationship where you guys could just hurt the fuck out of each other. You know? And here comes the controlling energy again. Okay, does somebody have to talk to their boss? Or are you being pressured into something that you don't want to do? Says there's going to be a lot of happiness surrounded around your situation. Somebody's dealing with a, a, a Aries or a Taurus, very controlling. Oh, but there's still going to be a lot of happiness around your situation. You know what I mean? Somebody getting a wish fulfillment, and you know that could be somebody getting, you know, everything they ever wanted. Okay. For those of you dealing with Leos, because I see Leo energy here, I feel like you're going to let that energy go. And there is nothing but heartbreak surrounded around that Leo energy, okay? For those of you dealing with Pisces energy, I feel like this person either want to communicate to you or you want to communicate to them, you know, and it involves healing. Somebody might want to work on something. It could be a co-worker for some of you, okay? But I feel like somebody doesn't want to put any energy into something and they have other options, okay? And don't get yourself in an off-balance situation, okay? Six of Pentacles reverse. This is you doing it alone, okay? Something is off-balance. Somebody is not, yeah, balanced with this give and take here. Six of Pentacles reverse. Not looking good at all. And that energy of that is, is Earth energy. Capricorn towards Virgo. Let me go on to my other cards here. What's happening, Aquarius? What's happening? Damn, damn, damn. Want to get y'all some good, accurate messages here. I don't want y'all stressing here about nothing. Some of you were dealing with earth energy in the past. I see somebody with earth placements. Oh, here we go with the damn food card. See, somebody wants to jump into something, you know, be some quick moving with this food card here. Somebody's dealing with an Aries. If this is an Aries, I feel like this may be a family member, somebody you're in a relationship with. And your situation definitely involves money, okay? Somebody might want security from you for themselves. Or somebody could be setting their own self up to jump into something that's going to take them downhill. I'm seeing that energy too. And I feel like somebody's been lying a lot. And I feel like their secrets are about to be revealed, okay? Somebody's going to find out that somebody has been using them from the motherfucker start. Okay? And here comes this air energy in reverse. Is this you speaking your truth? You know, piss the fuck off, or is it somebody else with air placements? If it is, I feel like this person cares about you and they're mad at you. <laughs> and I feel like they, they may be talking to you nasty because they care about you and you guys are separated, okay? Some of you have an on and off relationship, it's just back and forth. Two of Cups reverse, us each. If you're not separated from somebody already, you're going into separation, okay? There's a lot of things you don't want to jump into, okay? So I feel like you'd rather just let something go, okay? You don't mind being alone. You don't mind, you know, being a loner. That's what I'm hearing. But 
being like this is going to bring a lot of uh, depression into your life as well. See growth in a family situation for someone. Okay? I see that. Whether this is family or, you know, a love relationship, I see growth around it. But I feel like something, a cycle is going to end. You know, there's going to be a cycle that ends too. Whatever ends, I feel like it's, it's somebody just canceling something, okay? Somebody could be could have been um, starting something fresh and then they just decide to end it, all right? And I see your energy here. You're going to start. You're going to start being very stingy with everything, your love, your money. And then I feel like you're going to leave something behind that has been bothering you, okay? And you're going to start enjoying your money more, okay? And people might not say anything to you or you might not say nothing to them. If they don't say nothing to you, you're not going to give a fuck, okay? And some of you may take time off of work too as well, okay? Or you might not have a job. You know, your attitudes may change. You might get really moody or somebody around you might get moody. And you're going to see firsthand that you have a problem with somebody with water placements, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I just feel like somebody's not working or you're turning something down or you're making decisions about, you know, not waiting on motherfuckers anymore. You know what I mean? To do something. You're going to start feeling like, you know, there's no point of you dealing with a situation. I see a lot of you falling out of love with people and I see people watching you and you like crazy. They're trying to see if you're going to do something real fast. You know what I mean? They're trying to see if you're going to catch an attitude and be hot tempered and cold or and stop calling them, you know, and start blocking them. That's what, that's what they want to see. They want to see how your emotions is after they haven't talked to you, okay? They want to know if you're stressed out. Somebody is just in your motherfucking business too much. They want to know if, if you have stability in your life or if you're arguing with somebody or if you stop arguing with somebody or if you're heartbroken. Somebody wants to know all this fucking shit, okay? All this energy <coughs> is coming from air. You could be dealing with somebody with other air placements or you could have been dealing with somebody <laughs> That had water energy too. Oh my lord. It's a no this is a nosy bastard. Here. Like damn. Damn, damn, damn. That's all I'ma say. Let me look into my romance angels and see what I can come up with here. Aquarius. It's safe for you to love. Open your heart and give and receive the highest energy of all. Codependency. Okay? Addictions are affecting your romantic life. Okay? Some of y'all might know what this is all about. But there's addictions here. Okay? Reconciliation is showing up here as well. Someone from your fucking past is returning to your life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Could be water energy. Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Okay. Wow. I don't see any of you getting married right now. You know, I, I don't, I don't see you doing anything where you're spending a lot of time with somebody right now. But I do feel like some of y'all could get in a situation where you're getting to know each other because getting to, to know each other card came out, you know, as you reveal your innermost self to each other, your bond deepens. So by you communicating with somebody, they will know more about you, you know? Yeah. And that's a good feeling. You know what I mean? So, I'll talk to you guys later.